Special thanks and shout out to Community Chrysler Dodge Jeep and Ram of Bloomington, Indiana for allowing me to come out and film this 2018 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited Rubicon. Hello everyone, today let's take a detailed in-depth walk around look at this brand new 2018 Jeep Wrangler Unlimited JL Rubicon. And this Rubicon is painted in granite crystal clear coat metal metallic and it features the black leather interior with the ruby red accents. And Rubicon's R4 wheel drive, they feature the exclusive 4 to 1 Rock Track heavy duty part time shift on the fly transfer case. And Rubicon's are equipped with the True Lock 3rd generation Dana 44 HD front and rear axles with electronic sway bar disconnects. And off road data for the Rubicon are as follows the approach angle is 43.9 degrees with a departure angle of 37 degrees. The ramp breakover angle is 22.6 degrees with a ground clearance of 10.8 inches. Water fording depth is 30 inches at 5 miles per hour. And power comes from the standard 3.6 liter Pentastar dual overhead cam, 24 valve variable valve timing V6 engine with electronic start stop feature. It creates 285 horsepower at 6,400 RPM with 260 pound feet of torque at 4,800 RPM. It is good for 0 to 60 miles per hour in 6.8 seconds with a 0 to 100 mile per hour time of 20.1 seconds. Quarter mile is cleared in 15.2 seconds at 90 miles per hour, and top speed is electronically limited to 113 miles per hour. It is mated to the all new 8 speed Torque Flight 850RE automatic transmission with auto stick manual shiftability. The 2018 Jeep Wrangler and Wrangler Unlimited were unveiled at the Los Angeles Auto Show on Wednesday, November 29, 2017. They feature an all new yet familiar design that is reminiscent of the 1997 to 2006 Jeep Wrangler TJs with the rake front grille and round headlamps that integrate into the front grille. And around the rear, this Rubicon is equipped with the LED tail lights and turn indicators. The tailgate has a heavy duty tire carrier with a height adjustable third brake light. Mounted to the center of the spare tire and easily removed is the camera housing for the federally mandated backup cameras. Down below is the iconic red tow hook and in the center is the class two trailer receiver hitch with four and seven pin wiring. The all-new 2018 Jeep Wrangler JL will be available in four distinct trim levels, the Base Sport, the Mid-Level Sport S, and the luxurious lim unlimited-only Sahara, and the off-road ready Rubicon. Steering is electrically assisted recirculating ball. Wheels are the 17 by 7 inch polished wheels with black painted pockets. The tires are BF Goodrich All-Terrain TA Baja Champion tires and measure LT 285-70R17. Brakes are four-wheel disc brakes with assisted ABS, anti-roll mitigation, electronic stability control, and trailer sway dampening control. And of course the Rubicons are, are equipped with the skid plates front and rear. You've also got transfer case skid plates and fuel tank skid plates. Along the side of the vehicle are also equipped with rock rails. And up front, as you can see, this vehicle is equipped with the power dome hood, 
with active ventilation. And looking around the front, this Rubicon is equipped with the optional LED lighting group and it features high intensity LED headlamps with LED accent ring lamps and daytime running lights. On the body color fender flares are the LED driving lights with turn indicators. The iconic 7 slots grille harkens back to the 1986-1995 to YJ Wranglers. And this Rubicon is equipped with the heavy duty steel bumper which is winch ready and includes the iconic red tow hooks. Mounted lower still are the HID LED fog lamps. Alright, this vehicle is equipped with remote start as standard equipment. To operate is simple, just double press the remote start button on the key fob. Alright, we're going to take a look inside. And this vehicle is not equipped with the optional keyless enter and go smart key access system. And inside is all new for 2018 with upgraded materials and quality and attention to detail. As you can see, the door trim is all new. This features satin silver accents, power heated mirrors, power windows, and power door locks, soft touch armrest with a ruby red accent stitching, and down below you have your cargo net mat pocket. All new seat controls with driver's side lumbar support. The pull strap is your recline. Black leather covers the seats with ruby red accent stitching, and the Rubicon logo stitched in the seat back. The new seats are very nice and supportive and very comfortable. On the Rubicons, they are also heated. On the dash, you have your all-new lighting control with automatic headlamps and fog lamps, tilt and telescoping leather-wrapped steering wheel, and of course the Wrangler interior is still a hose-out design with easily removed carpeting. All right, pan through the interior and show a little more details. As you can see, nice fluid electrically assisted power steering. It is an all-new steering wheel with satin silver accent trim and the new control buttons for the reconfigurable display, Uconnect phone and Bluetooth controls, as well as cruise controls. Steering wheel does feature ruby red accent stitching. And of course you have an all new instrument cluster for 2018 with easily readable gauges, and a new seven inch thin film transistor trip computer and reconfigurable information screen. Plethora of options and vehicle dynamics. One of my favorites is the off-road page in page two, which shows your sway bar status as well as your steering angle. And on the second part of that, you also have your pitch and roll angles. And of course, as you can see it's completely reconfigurable with a plethora of information to help you personalize it to your taste. All right, sweeping over the top of the dash, as you can see, the dash top mounted speakers still exist. You've also got the accent stitching and little trinket trays on the top. True to Wrangler form are the circular air vents on either side of the radio screen. It is a new 8.4 inch touchscreen display with Sirius XM satellite radio. You've also got Uconnect inputs for Bluetooth, auxiliary, and USB. Dual zone automatic climate control. Uconnect apps, and the screen does feature swipe and pinch to zoom, heated seat and heated steering wheel controls, Garmin based navigation. This vehicle is also Apple CarPlay ready as well as Google Android Auto ready. Placing the vehicle in reverse activates the Parkview backup camera. It does feature active guidance lines and displays in crisp and clear graphics. And the molded bumper around the frame of the Uconnect screen helps to waterproof it. And moving down, you do have redundant controls for audio and climate controls, as well as heated seat controls and heated steering wheel controls. Most controls in the Wrangler are unique to the Wrangler itself. True to Wrangler form are the power window switches in the middle. And you've also had the USB and USB-C, as well as auxiliary inputs. And down below in the red panel are your front and rear axle lockers, as well as your sway bar disconnect.
through the center console. You have a four-wheel drive selector, cup holders, two-level storage in the center armrest with ruby red accent stitching on the top. You've also got the USB power point and it is illuminated. Overhead, you have a frameless automatic dimming rear view mirror, three channel home link universal garage door opener on the driver's side sun visor. On the mirror mounting post, you have your SOS and Uconnect access. Sun visors do fold down, feature LED lighting in the vanity mirrors. They do swing out and they also slide out on extension rails. All right, let's take a look at the rear seat. Rear seat treatment in the, continues as well as the front with the ruby red accent stitching, soft touch materials, and satin silver accents. The rear seats are all new for 2018. They feature redesigned seat units. It is a 60-40 split folding seat. Does seat three across. Overhead you have LED lighting. Speakers mounted in the sport bar. And one nice feature is the four position reading lights in the main center lighting, which is a good touch for the new Wrangler. Another nice feature is the Wrangler finally has a fold down center armrest in the rear, and it does feature actual cup holders, something that was never on the Wranglers before. And you have two positional air vents as well as your power window switches. You've also got the USB and USB-C power points back here as well, and a household style AC outlet. The Wrangler has become much more civilized now. Unique tethers for the Rubicon, as well as a seat back mount pocket. And folding the rear seats is still just as easy as it ever was, just by lifting up on the lever. This one releases head restraint, but pulling that big lever does everything. And the seat just folds flat into the floor. It's a one-handed operation. It's very easy to do. Lifting up on the seat back and locking it into place.
All right, let's take a look at the luggage area. The new tailgate trim, as well as the JL plaque in the tailgate is a nice touch. It is all trail ready. Luggage area is very nice and spacious, as one would expect from an Unlimited with the extended wheelbase. This vehicle does feature the Alpine audio system, and they've moved the subwoofer and amplifier back to the side wall. 32 cubic feet of space. You've also had a 12 volt power point, under floor storage, as well as your retaining holes for the windshield and door bolts. Alrighty, and this does conclude our in-depth walk-around look at the brand new 2018 Jeep Wrangler JL Unlimited Rubicon. We hope the review was informative, and as always, thanks for watching.